Hey everyone, Arthur Gaming here. I recently came across something new that I was very interested in. I thought maybe you guys might be too. Um, have any of you seen these Wardlings minis from the Wiz Kids Games? I uh, recently picked up some uh, and I wanted to show them to you. So you guys can find these on wizkids.com. Uh, they are their Wardlings minis. They're about $8 for a mini and a pet that goes with that mini. Um, and I thought they were pretty great. So uh, I figured if I liked them, maybe you guys would like them. So here uh, they are. All right, so the cool thing I like about these is every mini comes with a pet. Uh, so on top of just the minis, the character minis being awesome pre-painted WizKids minis, as you would expect, um, you know, with things like, uh, you know, there's translucent plastic on various spell effects and that sort of thing, um, which is pretty awesome. Um, just some interesting minis. So we have here, we have a, a girl wizard with a genie, uh, you know, a boy druid with a tree companion. You see he has some translucence. Uh, we have a boy rogue and his monkey, which, you know, who hasn't wanted to have a monkey in, in their life? We have a girl rogue with a badger. Uh, she looks pretty awesome. A uh, boy cleric with a winged snake. We have a girl... Or is it girl fighter and a hunting falcon, which I love the hunting falcon, the way it's flying in like the air. We have a boy ranger and his wolf. We have a girl ranger with her lynx. And we have a girl cleric with a winged cat. And then we have our girl druid and stone creature. So not only are these really cool minis, and yes, they're they're technically their children, and they're maybe a tad bit smaller than um than maybe the adult minis are but not much if they're anything they have a night paint nice paint scheme on them um and so the the character minis themselves are good uh very good however i think the real value here is the pets like if you take a look at these pets like number one here's a stone creature here's something you wouldn't normally find right so you can easily find like you know if you wanted to be a ranger with a wolf right so if you want to be a ranger with a wolf like this like this one here um you could easily find a ranger mini you could easily find a wolf mini but then the wolves the wolves end up being like these really big wolves right which maybe your min, your wolf mini or your wolf companion isn't that that big i think this is a like a better proportioned pet um same with like the lynx uh, the flying cat, which I, a, a, a winged cat, like where are you going to find that mini anyway? Like I love the little stone creature. I think he looks great. I really, like I said, I really love the falcon. So the falcon with that flying base on him or, you know, the translucent flying base. I think the falcon just looks really great. Um, again, a winged snake. Where are you going to find like a little winged snake? Um, we got our little badger, which, you know, awesome. Because honey badger don't give a, you know what I'm going to say. Um, got the monkey. Now again, where are you going to find a little tiny monkey like, 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 like that? That would be kind of an appropriate size for the, for the mini, right? Here's the mini. The monkey's pretty close in size. Like if we had the, you know, the monkey here, it's pretty good. Like that, that, that's a well-sized monkey for that mini. Um, there's a little tree companion, which is this cute little tree guy here, which is pretty awesome. Um, maybe for like a blight or something along those lines. And then this one too, like the genie is just awesome. Like this little bluish purplish genie with a book, uh, looking really cool. Uh, pretty awesome. So, I mean, I don't know about you guys. I mean, I know my son, for instance, he always loves having a pet. Um, every character he makes, he wants to have some sort of pet pet with him. Um, a lot of times it ends up being a wolf, like this little ranger here with like a wolf. But, you know, he doesn't want to play a ranger every single time either. He wants to play other characters and have pets with them. Uh, if you've, any of you have used the Wildemount book um, to do backgrounds the new wildemont book had lots of opportunities to get pets in there we're playing in a campaign right now and there's four or five of us um and each of us end up with a pet after the, after the wildemont book so you could easily do something like 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 that with these guys um make a campaign based around being kids and kids with pets going through dnd &D. i mean you could certainly do something like like that um so anyway check these out uh they are the um wardlings minis from whiz kids you can get them from their website you can get it from any friendly local gaming store again eight dollars gets you a character and a pet to go to go with it um i think they're pretty great looking um 
And guys, follow me on Instagram, uh, YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter at the Arthur of Gaming. I have more videos and stuff up there. Please give me some comments. Let me know what kind of stuff you guys want to see on the channel. I'm more than happy to put up more stuff to show you guys some some things, uh, and just in general show you stuff that I think is kind of cool. Um, and until then, it's a strange world out there, people. Stay safe.